Yo, what is going on guys? It's Hatchets here and today we have huge news for Call of Duty Black Ops Cold War Season 2. So we have a bunch of leaks guys and this is speculation so take everything with a grain of salt but we are going to start with a tweet from Tom Henderson. If you guys don't know who Tom Henderson is, he's a profound data miner and leaker for Call of Duty. He's always right for the most part. He doesn't miss. So we're going to start with his first tweet here and he said eight remake maps coming to Black Ops Cold War. So we already know that Summit, Jungle, and Fire range are coming back to the game. Tom Henderson said this, so if he has any reputability, we can point to the fact that he said that Nuketown is also going to be returning to Black Ops Cold War, and it did guys. We got Nuketown, so we are going to be expecting Summit, Firing Range, and Jungle, and then we also have eight more remake maps coming on the way, so those are probably going to be slums, probably Studio or Firing Range, like I said before, and then there was that one map called Standoff, I think it was called. I don't know. It was called Outlaw on BO3, and then we also also have hijacked coming back so the last time I think we saw hijacked was in black ops 3 it was called skyjacked and that's pretty exciting guys because we're gonna get a bunch of maps that we played before and basically we'll be able to play it once again I'm most excited for summit that was probably one of my favorite maps on there firing range was pretty good as well I'm just really excited to play these maps hopefully they change it up because in black ops 4 they also brought back these maps they weren't that interesting I mean they just had better graphics maybe they'll make something out of the remakes guys now for the next portion of the video for the next topic actually I wanted to discuss a new warzone map that is coming so we've actually covered this before but we are going to look at a tweet from Tom Henderson once again and he said new video premiering 250 players on the new warzone map so I made a video about the new warzone map it's actually going to be a combination of a bunch of dirty bomb and fire team maps so like sanatorium and it's going to be placed in the Ural Mountains we don't have a name for it but it's going to be in the Yamantau region I'm going to link the video in the top right hand corner of the screen that basically explains the whole composition of the map including specific locations within it what it's going to consist of I have a video covering all of that so we know that it's going to have parts of sanatorium which is the new fire team map and it's also going to have part of alpine which is a map with a bunch of ski slopes that we saw within the beta so rumor on the street is I mean from Tom Henderson once again he also said that this is only going to be available the 250 player map warzone version on next gen consoles so like PlayStation 5, PC, and Xbox One. It's not going to be available on last gen. So if you guys enjoyed the video, please remember to comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next one.